Hey everybody, it's Righteous Freed back with another Apex Arena video. This time featuring Shafaniel for the win versus Miu. Now, Miu, even though has the wedding skin for Shafaniel, does not have Shafaniel in the box, so we don't get to see a mirror match. But this is going to take place on the Cavern of Light. Taking a quick look at Miu's box, he's got Renata in there. You do not see her much. There's I've only seen her twice in my matches, and this will be the third time I've seen her, period. Now, Miu does have a behemoth juggler, so he does have an amazing offense right there. Pretty standard mix of single target with a little bit of AoEs. Does have Rosalia in here. Don't see her too much. We're going to jump into it now. Ros Rosencio is going to get banned first. And it's going to be a mirror ban. Shafaniel is going to fake Hilda. Ares and Lolly just get banned. And then Miyu picks up Zerida. Going for blood early. Hilda and Albedo get banned. This is going to be a rush versus a tank push. Elwin gets picked. Shafaniel knows what's up. Florentia and Liana are banned. So there's no healers on his side. And then Miyu picks up Helena. Lolly, Justin, Aries are banned for Miyu. Shelf is going to pick up Licorice. Ooh, Himiko and Reen get banned. Heavy hit. Miyu picks up Bernhardt, taking full advantage of only having Licorice to heal. In response, Florentia and Liana get banned. Neither side has a true healer. Deedlick gets picked up. Oof, Shafaniel and Zerida get banned. Miu picks up Licorice, though this Licorice is a demon. Ooh, the Behemoth and Rosalia get banned. Shafaniel's going to pick up Juggler, and Miu will then pick up Bozel. Now, with both Bozel and Licorice being demons, they do have higher stats, but will Licorice's Holy Class be able to deal enough damage? Will they be able to survive the onslaught of AoE's heal block and Helena coming up from out of nowhere? Let's find out. Juggler will provide some relief from that AoE damage. Ooh, Bernhardt. We're going to pause it real quick. Let's see. Go back. Bernhardt is going tank here. He did not bring Sword Dance. He wants to keep everybody protected. Knowing that Deedlit and Elwin are going to have cavalry. And then Hilda in this case. He has a big counter. It's going to be hard for them to bust through. Deedlit would definitely be able to get through the Stone Colossus. But I don't know how much will overflow. Still positioning. Zerida is going in for a Heart of Alhazard. Brought Dark Elf Sniper. Figured that Elwin would have Swordsmith Metal, so he didn't want to have to worry about whether fixed damage went through or not. Gospel on Juggler. Ooh, protection. Make sure there's a chance that Elwin doesn't get a heal block on them. Small chance. Now we're just going to take a quick look at their skills. Zerida is able to bring Backstab and Bloodbath, also the 3C Heart of Alhazard. Because Bozel took Dark Waltz, so that frees her up. She's going to have a lot of power here. Licorice has gone full healer, doesn't even have Transform. While Shelf's Licorice, fair mix. Let's see... Hilda's going to turn into a cavalry. Helena is going in. Ooh, just the wrong space. Elwin is going to go down. Crystal Blossom will finish him off. He will cast Mass Heal, getting rid of terrain and dealing a little bit of damage because the terrain is gone 
Helena does not get to recover after battle. Ooh. Oh, and the power of Deedlet. Taking out Helena, it's a 4v4. Now, Shelf is being wary of this area. Doesn't want to get any equipment disabled. Very slow. Shelf does have an advantage now with two tanks. And Juggler is going to go in. He will lock down Bozel. Chunking everybody in the process. Licorice will mass heal to render, render that pointless. Ooh. Fair bit of damage. Deedlet's gonna come. Oh, almost kills him through the Colossus. But Zerida, Zerida just annihilates Deedlet. Licorice will come in with Dark Despair to finish off Burnheart. Boza will sleep juggler. Let's see. Does he get out of V Shock? It looks like it. He did. Hilda will come in. Protecting juggler. Get a mass heal. And uh, Tango's gives him. HP recovery. That is perfect. Zerda is setting up for another assassination. Sacred Beast Tim is too far out to be used at the moment. I don't think he's going to get it up before the end of the fight. Ooh, Licorice gets silenced. Hilda's going to poke Bozo really hard. Those Crystal Warlocks are tanky. Well, Juggler comes in with a B-Shock, finishing off Bozo. Now this puts him at a perfect spot because of positioning. Licorice will die no matter what, and he'll be able to move Juggler last. This will effectively make everything a 3v1. Licorice here will die to Zerida, though. Oh, no. Pushes Licorice away. Licorice goes back to the same spot. Oof. But Licorice is locked down. All right. Zerida is doing as much damage as possible. Will not be able to trigger Hide and Seek anymore. But this will be a perfect spot. This will be the end because they're able to deal damage and Ram will be up shortly. Oh. Juggler finishes her off. Expertly played. That B-Shock to lock down Licorice there and kill Bozel at the same time. What a setup. Just goes to sh show you who's the better shelf. <laughs> oh, wait, she wasn't in the match. Haha. <laughs> All right. That was an exciting match. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like and subscribing. Do appreciate the support. Round of applause to Shelfaniel and Miu. Until next time, Righteous Freed out.